Hi Sagittarius, welcome and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we will be looking at your energies for the month of September 2023, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign. In this video, we will be looking at your past, present and future energies. Okay, so let's see whatever is coming up for you for this month. And uh, we will be looking at, uh, sorry, yeah, so this is basically a general reading and it may or may not resonate with all of you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. So Sagittarius, what's coming up for my Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign? I see options I see you are okay so this is the four of pentacles in at the back of your deck uh, so it's a feeling overall uh, Sagittarius that there are two people okay or two situations two directions okay but there are two things going on in your head you want to go to the other option okay you want to go to the other option but you somehow are restricting yourself to go towards the other option because of the first situation in which you are already in so the two two things which are in your mind whether to be in the situation where you are already are whether it's a love love thing whether it's a marriage thing whether it's your job whether it's something related to finances career i don't know but to stay in the situation or to move towards the other step okay so you are strongly standing over there and unable to decide all right so let's see we have the four of pentacles over here which is kind of telling us that you are strongly holding on to the present thing only you know just holding on just being there because of the other factors maybe whatever the factors are you have a lot of reasons to stay here although you want to go in the other direction but you are bringing so many factors so many reasons and I do not see any strong reason to stay honestly it's a holding on energy more where you are holding it on some if if a situation is arising in front of you that is definitely you know the universe really want you to see that situation that's why it has come in front of you otherwise it wouldn't have all right so in the past we have two of wands the hierophant and the chariot so this thing came in the past only it was like long back ago uh, it started coming up in your head you started to understand your situation you started to see a different you a different path a different thing and you somehow you know you tried to balance it like uh, you tried to you try to see that you know whether it's good or bad you started making reasons of the good and bad you know you might even have the good the the pros and cons of this situation the pros and cons of that situation so you are in the middle where you are a little bit of orthodoxity as well i feel that there is uh, somebody or you can be the person where you are you know oh this is not right you know this is not good i should not go there because of this and that blah blah so <laughs> but you really want to go okay but because of your society society matters for everyone the society issues coming up in you in within you you are like okay i cannot leave this person i, I cannot leave this situation what will people say what will my family say what will that person say what will that person say so yeah you are definitely in a very in the middle of very strong situation where you are also not ready that's why so much of confusion is coming up in your reading sagittarius very very confusion strong confusion in the present we have the knight of cups two of cups and three of wands 
if this is a love situation you are really getting a lot of love attention from the other direction or we can say whatever your situation is the other thing where you are seeing yourself where you are already in no 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 i'm not talking about that situation i'm talking about the other thing where you are seeing yourself but you are not there you are here but you want to be there and because of the societal pressure or other pressure whatever other reasons you are bringing up in your mind you are unable to touch that place you are not unable to go that place but that looks so phenomenal phenomenal good and beautiful and you know it, it uh, there is a lot of love affection or we can say a lot of possibilities strong possibilities meeting new people so a lot of things are coming up in front of you which are good but you are just able to see it from the distance see how this is that situation and this is you who is just seeing sorry this is the situation this is you who is watching the situation like you know wow if i will go to that situation that place this and this thing will come up towards me wow it's, it looks so good so let me just check whether you actually what do you, I don't know. Although I I know what you actually want, I do not need to check that card. But there is definitely an ending going coming up. So the future energy. Let me just tell you the future energies. We have the ten of swords and the world energy for you over here, which is the complete ending of a situation. I feel that yes, although you are in a strong. Um, a decision making state right now where you haven't decided yet but yeah the decision making will be coming up soon maybe not this month maybe next month but a decision making is coming up soon where you are ready to end your present chapter the present chapter is ending with the world and 10 of swords that yes there will be a lot of problems which will arise you know people will uh, people will put uh, bring you or you know put a lot of questions over you but yes because of your passionate behavior because of your passion you are definitely leaving that situation i feel you are leaving the situation in the future guys sagittarius and it feels good let me just take out one so this is my oracle deck the divine energy oracle and let's just see one card for you as the guidance for you for the situation any any card for my sagittarius my dear universe what's coming up for my sagittarius make no judgments see so it's a present card for you present guidance card that this something okay okay so make no judgments and nurture yourself first so this is the card nurture yourself first so if you are actually seeing that the other end is beautiful but have you nurtured yourself have you healed yourself yet if if yes then definitely go along with the towards that situation but if you have not even nurtured yourself if you do not even know whether it's good for you or bad for you then it's better to make no judgments yet okay i think this september month you should definitely do not make any decisions i don't know i was doing the reading of leos and aries as well and in their reading also very similar energies are coming up because of the mercury retrograde as you must be knowing about it till 20 till 25th of september try not to take any decisions make no judgments just focus on yourself during this time period try to contact less with people less connection because the more connection you will find the more talking you will do with people the more um you know a uh, fighting might happen so if you really feel that this is your video this is your reading it's very good but if you can if you can if you really want to know about your particular situation and whether it will be a good thing to decide wherever you want to go or not you can definitely come and have take a, a personalized reading with me as well guys because uh, you know this is a generalized reading as you all know so yeah but if you really feel uh you know taking a personalized reading with me i'm you know free for uh, for you i'm really uh, available for you so you can book an appointment with me the instagram page link and facebook page link and 
uh, whatever link is uh, all the links are provided below in the description box so you can definitely contact me message me dm me via those links all right so yeah that's all from my side sagittarius i hope this helps and we will meet you in the next video till then bye